Welcome to what will likely be the last, second last video, sorry, of the uh, Dreadfleet painting series. In this one we're going to look at the Scabrous, the Skaven ship, uh, which is like a giant fish with uh, some guts hanging out and cannons along the side. So here's what it looks like when I'm all done. And uh, these are the, basically the paints. So the, the main part of the skin was done with denim stone, uh, washed with Leviathan purple, re with denim stone, and then a little bit of skull white. Uh, the water was done the same way as all the other ones, so regal blue, enchanted blue, ice blue, um, a wash of bada black and thraka green, and then a bit of skull white. The uh, bell on the front of the the, uh, the bait there sort of thing for the fish was done with dark angels green, snot green, and scorpion green. Any of the metal bits were done started with tin bits, uh, shining gold, and then a little bit of chain mail. Some of the bone areas with camry brown, um, and I probably used uh, bleached bone actually, to, I don't show it here. The um, the wood bits, so I started out with a dark brown base coat and I highlighted those with graveyard earth. Uh, and Calton brown was probably used a bit in there and devil and mud. The red areas, mechrite red and blood red. So um, I started out with a dark brown base coat and I painted over with dead up stone. And uh, there's the regal blue on the base as well as the uh, macarite red. So um, nothing too fancy here, just uh, working my way through. Leviathan purple, nice heavy wash goes on all the skin there. And uh, I put a bit of bow red on that there, the, uh, the guts to help bring them out a bit. Okay, so I uh, got all that dry, so I'm putting my tin bits on here. And there's my... Uh, uh, Kemery brown on all the bone sort of things. And uh, working my way up to the front. And okay, so now some blood red highlights here. And you can see the, the wooden planks inside there. I don't know if you'll ever actually really see those in the finished thing, but um, so working my red highlights in there. there. Okay, so uh, some of the gold there. And you can see um, after a Devil and Mud wash, I'm redoing some of the uh, Kemery brown and trying to bring out some of the lighter browns there. And you can see up here working in the snot green over top of the Dark Angels green. Um, scorpion green going on top of that and do that a couple layers. And I've as well, I've uh, redone the denim stone here and uh, working towards my skull white. Um, some more red highlights there, and uh, that's the ice blue top highlight. Getting ready for the um, the final bits there, and uh, yeah, so I skipped a little bit. So there's um, I did a little bit of the hawk turquoise and dark angels green wash on the uh, metal bits. Um, I used some of the lighter browns on the rope just to differentiate that from the the wood, and I uh, glued it all together. Um, I think it was bleached bone. I just used a bit of that there, as well as highlighting these uh, spikes. And uh, this one here was a pretty quick um, paint job. I'm getting right near the end, so um, looking to finish. The only one left I have is the High Elf uh, Sea Drake. So uh, actually, I also had some uh, of the Cog ships, so the little tiny ships, but uh, I don't really count those. Okay, so um, that's it. Pretty uh, pretty simple for this model. Uh, the ship, and um, that's about it. Uh, the the skin obviously is, covers the major area, so I spent probably the most amount of time highlighting that up. So building up these these sort of layers here with the denim stone over top of the wash, and then a little bit of skull white here and there just to bring out the edge highlights. Hope you enjoyed this tutorial and uh, check out my blog. It's like watching paintdry.blogspot.com. Uh, you can add some comments there or request future videos. Hope you enjoyed the series and it's almost over. Stay tuned for the next one. See you next time.